morning class. Today I'm going to give you a brief overview on how to read, how to use the electronic version of a code book. Now let's take a look at the GSS code book uh, for assignment six. And you can see you have a PDF of the code book. So simply click on it and it will open up inside of Schoology for you. Now, you can search for variables inside of the code book on Schoology. I'm going to, for example, search for the variable called trust. Ta-da! And you see what it will do. It will search through the PDF document, show you the variable trust. It's wording and its values and value labels or you can download the PDF of a code book and this works with pretty much any code book that you have. Once you have your code book open you can search for it as a PDF file and you'll see this little link here you can show your thumbnails and continuous scroll and your Adobe PDF document. So say I'm searching again for them to use the same variable, trust, and it finds it for you on one page in the document. So there's your variable. Very easy to use a code book. You do not need to print hundreds of pages of any given code book. Now I have for place a paper copy in the classroom that can help you as well. But you can always, of course, simply search through the PDF document either by downloading it or you can do that also within Schoology. That's all there is to it. It's not that hard. Don't overthink it. Thanks for watching this video lecture for Social Work 300 and have a great day.